13. And wasting little time, the uh, approval has been given and the commands initiated to begin final approach for docking. And we are inputting the radial rate, 0 0.72. And uh, the docking assembly is in the center of uh, the sky. We turned on the headlight, copy. And uh, did you input the station keeping data? Yes, we did. And the point 0.7 rate, we are continuing the approach. I do not see the target yet. Do you copy us? Yes, we read you loud and clear. Please continue reporting. Yes, I am. Range 100 meters and rate 0.65. We can see the target one square below the center of a periscope. And we have a slight roll. Eighty five meters and uh, point zero five point four five. I can see the target one square to the right of the center of periscope. Flying high over Central Europe, everything continuing to go very smoothly as Soyuz Commander Sergei Volkov uh, aligns Soyuz TMA-12 uh, with the Piers docking compartment, uh, the docking port uh, moving into the uh, center of the uh, engineering crosshairs on the external camera of the Soyuz, this uh, all being uh, governed by the Corps' automated rendezvous system. We have a slight roll of about one to two degrees. Very good. Range 53 meters and point 24 per course data. The crosses are aligned and the target is half a square below the center of periscope and half a square to the right. Range 40 meters, rate point. Just 40 meters now separating uh, the new residents of the International Space Station. A good view of the Soyuz TMA-12 as it uh, flies some 212 statute miles above the Earth. R7 command. Yes, you have a go. Done. Continuing the final approach. The uh, Corps' automated antenna has uh, retracted as planned inside uh, 40 meters. Sergei Volkov uh, right down the path uh, for his docking to the pier's docking compartment. And we have the crosshairs aligned.
The Soyuz TMA-12 and the International Space Station now flying over the Russian-Kazakh border. All systems in excellent shape. Docking expected about six and a half minutes from now, perhaps a bit earlier. But we read you loud and clear. Range about 35 meters and uh, rate 0.2. At the time of contact and capture, the Soyuz will be traveling just one-tenth of a meter per second. Now you can see the view uh, from the external camera on the International Space Station showing uh, the Soyuz aligned with the pier's docking compartment. It will nestle into a docking port uh, right next door to the Soyuz TMA-11, the older of the two Soyuz vehicles uh, that will be the ride home for Peggy Whitson. Yuri Malenchenko and So Yun Yi just nine days from now. Range about 27 meters and rate 0 0.2. Crosses are aligned. Target is one square below the site, but in the center. And uh, do you have the base visible? No, not yet. And uh, do you have a sharp image? Does it need to be adjusted? No, it is uh, quite visible. Copy. And we have the base. We have 20 meters and rate 0.15. Target is to the right, one square to the right of the center of the periscope. This is normal. Understood. The dynamics are normal, everything is nominal. Good. We copy Vladimir Alexeyevich. Continue. The Soyuz and the International Space Station within range of Russian ground stations now. As you continue to watch a video from the external camera on the uh, Soyuz itself, moving uh, ever so close uh, for docking to the pier's docking compartment, now just 13 meters separating uh, the Soyuz from its destination. About 10 meters, the target is in the center of the periscope. And there is a slight misalignment uh, in the crosshairs, but uh, it is not significant. 0.17 right if you could say and select the range about seven meters the right hand board that'd be great the crosses are aligned there is a slight roll five meters now separating the two crafts standing by for contact and capture of the international space station we are preparing for contact. We have the docking confirmed at 7.57 a.m. Central Time over Kazakhstan. Thank you. The International Space Station now in free drift. Copy, page. A textbook arrival for the new residents of the International Space Station, Sergei Volkov, Oleg Kononenko, at their home for the next half year, So Yun Yi, arriving at the International Space Station for the next nine days. Now uh, we are at page 85. Proceed with page 85. Close. The visiting vehicle officer now reports that the docking probe has begun to retract. This will initiate the process of hooks and latches engaging one another to form a hard mate between the two vehicles and 